No matter what is your trade, profession or business, the tools that you use should help you rather than hinder you. They should enable your workflow rather than define it. Now, creativity and innovation are rooted in collaboration and teamwork. And in today's digital world, that means real-time collaboration for documents, spreadsheets, presentations, PDF files and so on. Only Office is an open source office suite that's perfect for businesses of all sizes. From startups to enterprises, it lets your teams work together super smoothly in real time with features like co-editing, tracking of changes, comments, and even a version history. On top of that, there is an offer of two gigabytes of free document storage on only Office doc space. In this video, I want to show you how it all works and what you can achieve with only Office. So if you want to find out more, please let me explain. First off, I'd like to thank Only Office for sponsoring this video. Now, Only Office comes in a whole variety of different flavors depending on your exact needs. There's desktop versions, there's web versions, there's mobile versions. You can self-host it on your premises. Now, in this video, I'm gonna be concentrating on the desktop versions because that's the quickest and easiest way to show you everything you can achieve with Only Office. Okay, so the first step is to download and install Only Office on your PC. Here I am on onlyoffice.com. Move over to the download button here, go down to the bottom and select desktop and mobile apps. Here you can see it's available for Windows, Mac OS and Linux. So if you're going for Windows, best to use this one here, the recommended one, the online installer for basically all the popular versions of Windows. Click download, that will download the file, double click on that and you can install. If you scroll down a bit, we've got the Mac OS version and then here we can see it's available just about every flavor you want for Linux, including uh, .deb files, .rpm files, snap packages, app image packages and so on. In fact, if you scroll down a bit more, you can actually see there are some versions that come pre-installed with only Office. And it's also available in the stores, the software stores of Linux Mint and Zorin OS. So basically, it's a really easy to get hold of only Office. Installation is fairly straightforward. And so here I am with uh, it running on my Windows uh, desktop. And the first thing you're presented with here is his ability to connect to the cloud. And this is really, really important because of course, working in a team, working with other people, you're gonna be able to share your work. And the easiest way to do that is with the cloud. So there's only Office Cloud and you can click on that and you can connect to it. If you don't have one, you can go over and create an account that'll give you two gigabytes of free. You can either go in with your Google account or sign up with an email address and a password, really, really simple. Okay, so once you're all signed up and signed in, you now have a doc space area. And if you notice up here at the left, you can see I've got the only office thing, and then I've got my doc space. So here inside of my doc space, I can go to documents. And let's say now I want to create a new word processor document, a new document. So I got to hit that plus sign, hit new document, and let's call it in an age of tech. Okay, and that's now gonna open up the word processing part of Only Office. Okay, so here I am in the document editor and we can just go ahead and uh, create ourselves uh, a document. Let's just give it uh, a title. Then, you know, you can go and change that to, you know, just the, the, the heading there I've picked. We can put in some text here, uh, just like we're not gonna type it. I'm gonna cut and paste it. There you go, there's some text. Uh, and of course, you know, you can do all kinds of things, you know, you bold and, you know, all the things, you know, up here you can look at all these bullet points and everything, indentation, you know, the fonts, just like you would expect, of course, like you'd expect from any kind of uh, editor. So there we go. That is that document created now. And I'm just going to make sure it's saved there inside of my cloud. Okay, so here I am on Linux now and I've installed only Office here on Linux. Uh, and it's already running and I've got that document open. I just wanted to show you something. If I went away now and just, you know, made this underline, okay? Something simple like that. Let's just quickly now go back to the Windows version. Okay, so here I am back on Windows and you can see that the word algorithm has now has been underlined. So basically there's collaboration editing here. So on Linux, on Windows, on Mac OS, in fact, we'll see in a minute on Android, wherever you're gonna use it, you can, uh, you know, can work together with your colleagues, with your teammates, and you can get all this stuff done, even if you're both editing the same document, collaboration editing at the same time, absolutely brilliant. Okay, let's go ahead and create a new spreadsheet. Uh, a really cool spreadsheet. Okay, we're not going to do anything too amazing. We know we're going to just put 
uh, you know, price, and we can change that to a title quickly here. Look, there you go, heading one, no problem. Let's make it a bit bigger. Now I'm just gonna put some numbers in here. 188. Now I'm just showing you this is a normal uh, spreadsheet, of course, compatible with uh, Microsoft uh, Office, and we're just going to do the sum now of A2 through to A9. Okay, there we go, and we could maybe put that, uh, you know, as a you know, that's the calculation. Okay, now again, we can save this now in the cloud, and now I want to go over to my Android device. Okay, here I am on my Android phone. I've installed only Office via the Google Play Store. We can launch that now. I've previously connected it to my cloud account. So we can go over to here. And there we can see a really cool spreadsheet. That was one we created. And that's going to open that now here on my Android device. And as you can see, exactly what we created. The point being that you get access to all your documents, spreadsheets, presentations, and so on here on mobile as well. Now, I mentioned there a moment ago that it's a compatibility with Microsoft Office. Here I've got Chess History Unveiled a very simple uh, presentation I've created. Now notice here it's a .pptx file. In fact, we right hand click it on go to info. There we can see it's a, a .pptx. So it's a Microsoft Office file. Okay, and of course I can still open it here inside of only Office. And here it is and here are all the slides that I've created. And of course you can actually present it if you had your laptop, you can go ahead and present that here and then make your way through the different slides, including transitions and all that kind of stuff. So, you know, uh, it is a proper Office suite that's compatible with all the other major Office suites. Now I'd also like to show you the PDF form editor. So we can go ahead and create ourselves a blank PDF form. We'll just call it, uh, it's actually gonna be a vacation request form. So vacation PDF form. Okay, I'm not gonna spend too much time uh, on just, you know, actually making this nice, but we can do something like this. You know, you can have, uh, you know, vacation request form. Okay, and that's gonna be, so we can a heading, so we can turn that like that. We can have, you know, first name, uh, surname, and then uh, start date. Okay, I could go on and make this, you know, obviously much, much more, but the point is here, is now I can go ahead and insert a text field. So there you go, and line that up nicely. Okay, I can go down here and insert another text field. And of course, look, all the lining up stuff does that automatically look, you know, all the clicking into the right place. That's absolutely great. Uh, and now finally, we're gonna put start date. And so here we can actually, actually there's a field for dates. So look, your date and time field. Okay, so that's in there. So that's actually great. So you can actually go ahead and collect, uh, you know, make a date and time on that. So now I can just save this as a PDF and then send it around. And then it's easy for other people to fill in and then email it back, whatever the system you've got is. But creating a PDF form is really simple. To try OnlyOffice, go over to onlyoffice.com and there you can download the desktop apps as I have shown you. While you're there, check out their other plans that they have, which are there as you grow your business. My name is Gary Sims. This is Gary Explains. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Okay, that's it. I'll see you in the next one.